Republicans have a new party chair. A 60-year-old salesman from North Fayette was elected to replace D. Raja, who resigned after losing uh, an election for state senate. The new chair is Allegheny Councilman Sam DeMarco. Political editor John Delano sat down with him this afternoon. When Republicans in Allegheny County voted in the May primary, there were no Republican candidates running for most countywide offices. Is the Republican Party broken in Allegheny County? I, I think it absolutely is or was because we're going to fix it. County Councilman Sam DeMarco is the new chair of the county Republicans. In our failure to even field candidates for positions, we're not giving the people a choice. No Republicans filed to run for district attorney, treasurer, county controller, and five of the seven county council district seats. DeMarco pledges to change that. So who is Sam DeMarco? I was born and raised in Mount Washington and Beachview before I joined the Marine Corps when I was 17 years old. Upon returning from the Marine Corps, went to school with uh, Community College of Allegheny County and the University of Pittsburgh. Trained as a glazer in the building trades, DeMarco moved on to sales and led a Tea Party affiliate called Veterans and Patriots United. Now as party chair, DeMarco wants to rebuild the local Republican Party. I need to build the infrastructure. I need to increase the number of members that we have here. I need to bring folks that are interested, folks whose core values align with ours, people in the pro-gun, pro-life, pro-school choice groups. Does President Trump make it easier or harder for you to rebuild the Republican Party in Allegheny County? He's making it easier because I'm telling you, there is a tremendous amount of enthusiasm around him. DeMarco praises Trump's economic policies, but what about Trump's tweets, like those about the four Democratic congresswomen? Are those remarks that you would embrace? I probably wouldn't say that. <clears throat> but what you're seeing here, you're seeing 2020 politics already. You're seeing Democrats coming out and accusing him of being a racist because with a booming economy, no president has ever lost in their run for reelection. So they've got to try to make him unacceptable. Is he a racist? Absolutely not. Now, of course, everyone has an opinion on that question. It's important because the perception of President Trump may have played a role when Democrats won two special elections locally. Connor Lamb for Congress and Pam Iovino for State Senate. Suburban Republican women voted for those two Democrats and will be key in 2020. Allegheny County was the only county in Western PA that the president lost in 2016. DeMarco predicts Trump will do better here in 2020.